The Easy Peasy Way to Quit Porn by Hack Author Squared. This is the version that can be found on easypeasymethod.org and was last updated on April 20th, 2021. Preface. Do not jump chapters. Painlessly quit porn immediately without willpower or any sense of deprivation or sacrifice. This is a rewritten version of a rewrite adapting Alan Carr's easy way to stop smoking for pornography. It is also completely free and open source. I'm not the original author of either of these books. I am the hack author squared. It's very effective, but critical to your success requires that you do not jump chapters. When opening a combination lock, you have to enter the numbers in the right order. Addiction isn't any different. Personally, the original Google Sites version that wasn't written by me changed my life. If you're anything like most people, you discovered porn when relatively young and have used it ever since. Until stumbling across the overwhelming yet somewhat censored literature warning of the dangers. Like myself, you have probably succeeded with streaks of various lengths, but have always eventually succumbed to illusory urges. I am pleased to report this method worked entirely differently and has been the only method that has worked. Or perhaps you have been linked this book by a concerned party and are skeptical. Firstly, thank you for at least looking at it. This will be expanded upon shortly, but please briefly recall the first time you looked at porn. Did you expect that you would return to it for the rest of your life? According to my own informal studies on the matter, pestering friends to read this book, easy peasy is equally as effective for the casual porn user as it is for the heavily addicted. It's not terribly long, with high chances of large gains, so I beg you to keep reading. The method described in this hack book is instantaneous, equally as effective for the heavy and casual user alike, causes no bad withdrawal pangs, needs no willpower, requires no shock treatment, aids, or gimmicks, won't cause you to replace this addiction with other addictions such as overeating, smoking, or drinking, and finally, permanent. You might find this impossible to believe, but this sentiment is echoed by many people. Quote, this is a seminal work on porn addiction, end quote. Some guy on Reddit I can't find, don't think the pun was intentional. Quote, I was addicted for 10 years. Those 10 years, I was crippled with depression, doubt, anxiety, and fear of my secret getting out. After every session, I hated myself, and after every porn diet, I was back down the water slide in no time. However, this book helped me stop. I was always on the defensive against porn in the past. Now, after reading this book twice, I am on the offensive. Porn has no control over me and feels like a sad joke now." End quote. You slash Deep Newt. Quote, a few days ago, I turned 20 years old. For the first time in a very long time, I spent my birthday free from the porn trap, and it's all thanks to this book that I haphazardly stumbled upon only a few months ago. Before that, I had spent so much time trying to quit through traditional means, and I experienced so much inner turmoil and labeled myself permanently as an addict. The book solved all that for me. Where I previously feared I had no control over myself, even when I'd unknowingly already beaten the little monster, I can now find pride in realizing I don't need to be an addict anymore. I don't really have a reason for posting this. I just felt like I needed to put this down somewhere other than inside my head because it means so much to me. If you're reading this and are thinking about reading or recommending the book, take it from me that it works better than any other method out there. My biggest tip is to take notes, which sounds funny, but it really helped me solidify certain ideas." End quote. User suspicious underscore web underscore four five 
1994. Quote, based, end quote, anonymous. Alan Carr is a top bloke with an exceedingly interesting life, a hundred a day chain smoker for over 30 years. Carr stopped immediately after discovering Easy Way. And as quoted from his book, this enabled him to follow an overwhelming desire to explain his method to as many smokers as possible. His methods for alcohol, other drugs, and many other addictions remain global bestsellers, and I'd encourage you to check them out. His body of work deals with dispelling fear caused by misconceptions and confusion regarding biological processes and quitting. Therefore, a majority of the book is spent logically deconstructing anxieties and phobias associated with quitting that generally lead to the downfall of many who attempt and fail. Carr's clinics have success rates of over 95% with money-back guarantees. More importantly, they have allowed their patients to go on to live fulfilling lives free of their addictions. Why the Hackbook? Because Alan Carr has long since passed away and the institutions he's formed don't list internet pornography as one of the addictions they provide treatment for. I don't gain monetarily or otherwise. A hack book is a book based and hacked from another book. The original author is fully credited. Throughout this book, myself, the original hack author, and Alan Carr will appear transparently in order to provide you with a unique and compelling method to easily and painlessly quit. Tips for reading. Don't read this book like a normal book. It's very short and you should be able to finish it within a couple of hours. Most people benefit from highlighting or taking notes and usually recommend rereading it a few times to fully solidify the lessons. A number of communities exist for the hack book as well, but I would recommend checking them out only after you have finished reading the book. A quick reminder, do not jump chapters. I would wish you luck, but as you will soon come to learn, you don't need it. Good vibes. Hack Author Squared.